Yes. Uh, respected all the teachers, uh, now it is a fourth and fifth day program we are leading. So in this we teach uh, capital letters. Day four we teach uh, uh, 13 capital letters. Day five remaining 13 including numbers. So zero to nine numbers. Okay? And each and every letter how to write it I am writing. Please follow my way. First A, starting from the first line, bend, if we call it as a first bend, slanting line, lift up and fold. B, first bend, C, fold and touch, make a little fold and lift and fold. And C, a cross egg shape of fold, lift and fold around in the first bend. D, slantly come down and make it L fold, lift up after crossing this, fold inside. E, make it L fold, then C, touch the upper line, extend and not there, horizontal bend and not in. F, first bend as usual, C fold and touch, extend and not, horizontal bend not. G, Cross edge shape, uh, stroke to the second line, joint separate fold, intersect extend from that. Lift up, hold it around in the first turn, attach. H, it's a first bend, C fold and U attach. Bend and slant. Horizontal bend. I, the first bend, slant we come down and fold. J, Slantly come down and lift up, fold around, C fold and U attach, J, K, first bend, C fold and attach, take a gap, bend and slantly come down, back side not, come down and fold. L, first L fold this one, first bend and fold and extend, and from the line, lift up and fold it around in the first one. Then M, First bend, slantly come down like A, join and reach the second and bend. Join here, slantly come down, turn to the right. Okay. So till here, 13 letters. 13 letters. The next two, fifth day program will start. Pass it. Now, it is a fifth day program. It's a final day. So in the fifth day, we start with the N. First bend, join and drop, check the gap at the middle, bend and attach this uh, point, attach here, M. O, it's a simple big oval shape, touch the upper part, move it a second line, fold. P, first bend, C fold and touch the upper part, Slantly come down after crossing the second line, fold inside. Q, cross egg shape of a movement, touch, second line, bend, then same go, but you make a bend like this. Okay. R, it's a first bend, C fold and touch the upper part, make it round shape. Below the second line, and not in behind the first bend, come down and leave a triangle shape and fold. Uh, yes, half zone, you write it like a, take the shape of a half fold, then it's a far backward slanting line, then turn completely back and fold. T, it's a first bend, then C fold and touch the upper part, just to extend and lift. Up. U, it's a cross, question mark kind of fold, it's looking like a question mark. So slantly extend to the height, the back at the same line, separate and fold. Question mark, bend, cross line. Then why I am writing? So, join till here and separate and fold. So these are somewhat closely together. That is what I am writing here. Okay. Then we, the slightest turn is straight. Then it's a slant bend, make it too much turn in the first turn. Then attach, C and U attach. Once again. Bend here, take it gap, bend, slightly come down, attach, C fold, U attach. 
double straight bend slant bend straight bend slant bend c u because these are the two hard letters that that is what i am writing two times okay straight slant straight slant then c u one x it's a turn slantly come down slant extend come back turn and four x y all the complete z c u attaching to the slanting length then then four c u attach slanting length then four so these are the all the letters then i'm coming with the numbers just see i am writing the numbers with a different color please look at here look at look at here so it's a number 1 One, two. The moment you observe it carefully, teachers. Three, three, four, four, five, five, six, six, seven. Seven, eight, eight, nine, nine, zero, zero. So these are the numbers. In this way, we have to write it. The numbers size must be in the capital letter size. So these numbers are uh, used to write the years or something in the text. Okay. but we shouldn't use this in a mathematics okay thank you very much teachers i hope you understand everything